Check it out guys, so we just came over here, the vibes are popping, people are dancing, people are going crazy. Good dancing, keep on dancing, you dance like this. <laughs> They're all dancing in Malaysia. Satu Malaysia! Look at this guys. Malaysia Day. Happy Malaysia Day everyone. So currently we're in Kuala Lumpur right now. I'm here with my friend Elena. And today we want to celebrate Malaysia Day. And uh, yeah, we're just super excited. Right now I'm wearing the traditional Malay hat, a Malay t-shirt. She's wearing the sarong. sarong, which is like a traditional Malaysian skirt. Well, that being said, guys, we're right now in KL Central Station, which is like the central station of Kuala Lumpur main station of everything and you can see a lot of people are just wearing traditional outfits i heard there's going to be some events happening yeah. so let's go and check it out right now we just reached this one area of the station where there are so many people a big crowd they're chanting as you can hear and yeah let's go more inside it's gonna go around Wow, look at this guy, what he's wearing. Nice bro, can I see your alpha real quick? Yes. Okay. <laughs> what is this traditional? Uh, this is from Iban, from Sarawak. From Sarawak, mm, yes. awesome, I like it. Mm -hmm. Has the bird on the top and then the feathers. Very nice. Yes. Happy Malaysia Day. Happy Malaysia Day. Yeah. So we got the train over here. Actually, when we're entering, this is like we saw all this crowd, so that's why we came over here. Your dress looks beautiful. Are you uh, Malay, Malaysian, or <laughs> Malay? Okay, awesome. Indian culture. Indian culture. Oh, okay, cool. Nice. I, I was just saying how, like, in Malaysia, a lot of people have like different types of like their ethnic cultures. So like, they like wear like different traditional. I don't know if you guys can hear me. Different traditional clothing. I think the girl on the right of her looks like she's wearing maybe something Chinese. Yeah, maybe. Mm -hmm. But also, do you know why we celebrate today? Yeah, this is when uh, Sabah and Sarawak came part of Malaysia. So, like, e Malaysia is split up in two parts, guys, Western and Eastern. So, the Eastern Malaysia came together with the West part. So, that's why everyone's celebrating this day. Yeah, like geographically split, but sat to Malaysia. One Malaysia. One Malaysia, exactly. Look at this, they're doing some uh, traditional Malaysian martial arts. Nice! Alright guys, so the event uh, just finished from KL Central Station, which is the main station of Kuala Lumpur. And now everyone's migrating to this one area called Masjid Jamik, which is a famous mosque over here. And I'm sure I recorded it too before uh Masha Jamik area but yeah, everyone's migrating so we're just gonna go with the crowd and wow as you can see so many people and I just wonder how long how long do you think it's gonna take to go on the metro right now? I really don't know like this is like rush hour times 10 right now so I'm a bit nervous but if all else fails we just go outside to go but yeah, it's been like a long time. Ahead. You see everyone, like every person that's walking, including myself, we're just holding like their camera, their phone, and just recording everything. So right now you can see guys, everyone is chanting to wait for the metro. They're trying to, you know, keep the spirit alive. So it's pretty funny. And you see a lot of Malaysian flags. Hello. Hi guys, Salam Atari Malaysia. America. <laughs> now time to go up the escalator guys, look at this, wow. That's it, oh. Time to get in the metro guys. 
gonna push and bunch up. Oh, this brings no, back memories. I don't need a white no. lens, and I just don't have a white lens. <laughs> okay, the air quality is so much better. <laughs> Satu Malaysia. Check it out, guys. So we have just reached Merdeka Square, the famous Merdeka Independence Square of Malaysia. And it looks like there are a bunch of things that are happening over here. A bunch of street vendors, uh, some blow up house for the kids. Let's just go and see for ourselves. Look at all the beautiful pictures. There's the second tallest building in the world too, guys. Just in case you don't know. A lot of people are wearing the tanjuks. So cool just to see the different like outfits and like traditional wear, wear that like Malaysian people are wearing. Everyone's got their own style. I don't feel colorful enough. I feel like everyone looks so colorful and I just don't look enough colorful. Next year. That's I'll true. You, you see a lot of things like shiny stuff and uh, even some jingles like some other types of materials. Wow. Selamat datang ke Grand Pisoro 2023. Yeah, there's, there's a lot of stuff to see over here. And I think right over here is they're playing traditional Malaysian games. They're playing with the tops. Have you ever seen this? They play with these like tops and they like battle each other. What? Hey, let's go around the other side. You can get better. Yeah, that's like a traditional Malaysian game they play over here. It's one, like, it's one time I went to uh, Merdeka Square and they were playing these like Malaysian games. There's like all these different types of local games. It's pretty cool. And one of the things I did see was this. Wow, that's really cool. Yeah. Do you think you could do that? Yeah, I think so. I think I got it. And they had different types too. Like some are like bigger, some are smaller, some are faster. So it's kind of cool. Wow, how fun. Okay, should we continue, right? Yes, we should. Let's go. Should we go this way? Why not? All right, guys, so at this event, as you can see, there's a lot of food stalls, clothing stalls, and something we did see, they even have like, uh, hello, hello, hi. We also, welcome to Malaysia. Thank you. Salamat datang ke Malaysia. He's like, well, I can speak Malaysian. <laughs> Look at that. that that's like a rock climbing thing. Yeah. You dare me? If it's not a long line, I would, but let's see, let's see. Yeah, it seems like a long line, unfortunately. No, 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 no. excuses, excuses. No, honestly, I don't mind. I don't, I don't mind rock climbing, guys, but I just want to take a, a time. I'm burning up, guys. It's like 100 degrees Fahrenheit. Oh, wow. I feel really exhausted. I need to get something to hide, like hydrate me. Well, we're very hot, so we're like, let's sit down in the shade for a little bit. And also, we got some free coffee. So, shout out to that coffee company. Wanda. Wanda. Well, we don't have to mention its name. They're not sponsoring us. <laughs> but they are sponsoring the event. Okay, but anyways, sponsor us. <laughs> but anyways, yeah guys, we're just sitting down chilling out because we've been like walking for hours in crowds, kind of hot, but we're still enjoying it, having a good time. So we just want to like simmer down a little bit and then continue with the festival because there's a lot more to see and a lot more to explore. So that being said, let's open this up, pop it open and cheers. cheers. I forgot to say bismillah. Bismillah. Let's do it one more time. It's actually good. I don't even like coffee, but this is nice. I like it because it's like a latte. Mm. It's 
I'll tell you. It is. And I think Wanda Coffee is actually a Japanese name brand, if I'm not mistaken, because they have a lot of... Yeah, it's Japanese. Makes sense, right? Have you guys can see the difference between, like, Japanese and, like, Chinese? Japanese uh, words are usually, like, the hitagana and katagana are usually... Uh, they're not straight. They usually, like, are... I don't know, guys. I'm tired. I need this coffee. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, like, really, like, my brain's not functioning. Yeah, because I've been up since like 7 a.m. and I didn't go to sleep till like 2. Yeah. Check it out, guys. So we just came over here. The vibes are popping. People are dancing. People are going crazy. A good dance. You keep on dancing. You dance like this. <laughs> They're all dancing in Malaysia. It's so fun. <laughs> good job. Hello. Huh? America. Where are you from? Malaysia? Yeah, yeah. Beautiful dancing. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Nice to meet you too. They dance very nice. Yeah. Professional dancers. <laughs> oh, she is? Yeah. You're actually a professional dancer? Yeah. Oh. Indian classical dancing. Okay, cool. Are you guys from KL? Yes. Yeah. Awesome. This is my first time in Malaysia Day here in Kuala Lumpur, so I want to like record all the vibes and see how it is. Yeah. Alright, awesome. Nice to meet you guys. Nice to see you. Bye-bye. Nice Thank you. I never, I never seen people dance so much over here. Have you? You see, guys, this is why I love Malaysia. They're so lively. Very lively, yeah. Uh, I'm not know what you're gonna watch. We're just gonna <laughs> Sure. <laughs> this is kind of wild out. <laughs> guys, this is halal party. No drinking. Just positive vibes. Wait, 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 check this out. Like, guys, look at all of us. Look, Elena, if you see all the cans right, right across from us, no alcohol. Just coffee. Look. Yeah, just coffee. Yeah, yeah, look at this. Coffee, some energy drinks, water. Guys, so I just walked away from the stage, which is right over there. Very lively, a lot of things to see. But something that I also want to show you over here is a lot of people are playing a lot of local Malaysian games. And I hope you can hear me because it's very loud over here. Let me show you some like local Malaysian games. This looks like hacky sack. Wow. Very talented. Hacky sack, check this out. No, I can't do it. <laughs> I can't do it. <laughs> Yay, I did it. <laughs> wow, it's actually not that hard to like, once you get used to it, it's not that hard to dribble. Awesome. Thank you guys. <laughs> 
It's really cool. Mandarin United Malaysian Hindu voice. Let's see, let's see what else they have. Senior kicking the ball. Yeah, you saw I got some skills. Guys, I still, I still got some skills. I'm getting older, but I still have some skills. You know something what I love about Malaysia? It's so hot outside, but it, like we don't care about the heat, we care about having fun. Betu, betu, yeah, it means true, true. Huh? Betu, it means true, true. Trip, trip? True. True, true, oh, true. Let's see, what's, look, look at this, Malaysia Madan, what is that? I don't know, let's just see inside, what is it? We can. What is this, Malaysia Madan? Alright, there's one I see inside. All right, cool. Maybe we go to Air Asia and see what's going on. Air Asia, yeah, I think we go there. Yeah, Malaysian Airways, by the way, Air Asia. <laughs> yeah, because I said earlier in the video, I don't know if we're going to leave it out, but I saw Air Asia, I was like, oh, Air Malaysia. No, no, you're putting that in, actually. I don't know if I'm going to put it in the video, guys. Oh, you will be, you will be. Let's see, let's see. Am I on right now? I am on, okay, cool. Because Air Asia is from Malaysia, so it's called Air Malaysia. <laughs> You know, I'm gonna play around with the Air Asia people when I see them. I'm like, hey, are you guys Air Malaysia? And see what they say. What's the reaction? Oh my god, it's so hot. So hot. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Is it, this is actually a funny game. Uh, I guess uh, apparently, like, three or four people will go on these wooden boards and then they'll have to walk and get with each other and they have to race people. And they have the stills over here. Bole. Oh, very beautiful. Come on, you do it. Uh, probably, I don't know. Bole. Yeah. You want me to try? You should try. But I think they're having a race. Or, I don't know, are they? No. Uh, this one looks like you have to be coordinated with people, right? Yeah, true. You gotta do it with your friends that you know and you trust. Yeah. Oh, look at this guy, little dragon boy. Check it out, guys. So over here, this is Air Malaysia. So the Malaysian Airlines. So like a lot of people. Air Asia, not Malaysia. What? Not Air Asia? Air Malaysia is Air Asia. No, no, just play. I just play. You guys look very nice. Are you guys? Are you guys flight attendants? Yeah, we are flight attendants. Okay, awesome. What flight do you go on? We are flying to Australia, Japan, China, Korea. So you guys can speak multiple languages, right? Come again? You can speak multiple languages. Oh, she can speak Japanese, both of them. Yeah, we I are can speak Chinese. Language. Oh, Nihongo! Yeah, Nihongo! Nihongo! Konnichiwa! Those are Yoroshiko. Yoroshiko, no gaishimasu. No gaishimasu. No on board. Okay, and what about you? Malayu, English? Malayu, Sabahan, Slovakian. Oh, okay, awesome. Malaysia. So, uh, what, what are you guys uh, passing out today? Come again? What are you guys giving today? Anything? We are free? performing just now on the stage, on the main stage. Oh, the big, the big dance? I don't know if you guys saw like the CEO and everybody was like dancing and stuff. Awesome. Awesome. But Air Asia is based in Malaysia, right? Yeah, we actually have a few uh, Air Asia Malaysia, Air Asia Indonesia, Air Asia Philippine. But the main the main company is in the Malaysia. Main Air Asia Group is in Malaysia. Okay, so Air Malaysia. No, I just I just I just like with you. Yeah, that's right. Uh, all right, cool. That's awesome. And what is this part of your? No, it's a difference. Oh, foreign fresh. Ah, okay. Awesome. Fourteen years of low cost airlines. I like it. I'm actually gonna fly Air Asia to uh, Taipei. Oh, yeah, so maybe I'll see you guys on the flight. Yeah. Do you guys ever fly to Taipei? Yes, we do. Do you ever do the uh, Taipei flight? Yep. Maybe I'll see one of you guys on yeah, it. Maybe. Right. Well, what's the difference between Air Asia and Air Asia X? We actually Air Asia X flying low, uh, long haul. Oh, okay. And the Air Asia will be flying. But do you guys only fly Air Asia or Air Asia X? Air Asia X. Air Asia X. Oh, okay. Fly Air Asia. Air Asia. Okay, nice. All right, cool. Nice to meet you guys. Nice yeah. to meet you. Bye. Those are your Gambate, call us I. Awesome. Yeah, okay. It's funny when I tell them Air Malaysia. But is there an Air Malaysian a company? I know there's Balik Air or something. Balik? Malaysian Airways. Malaysian Airways. Oh, okay.
Oh, so oh, they didn't tell us you could spin the wheel and win something. Say what? There's a huge wheel. Yeah, because I asked them, I was like, what are you guys doing? They're like, oh, we were just dancing. Yeah, just dancing. But look at this. Wait, let me just show real quick. The... Let's see what you could win. You'd win a, oh, a tow bag. Hell yeah. Look at this. We could win a chance to win a free flight. Keychain, foldable fan. I love to see this. Guys, this is why I love Kuala Lumpur. Like, a lot of you guys are like, why are you staying in Kuala Lumpur? This is that. Every week there's some sort of event. Just two weeks ago they had a Malaysia, Malaysia Independence Day, about two weeks ago. Now it's Malaysia Day. And now probably a week or two, there's going to be another event. There's also the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him. There's his birthday coming up too, so maybe there's some special event for that. Yeah, so just always there's events happening in Malaysia. Nestle Milo. Oh, look at this. You see, even people are taking photos of Milo. That's how much I love it. Whoa, are you sure you want Milo? <laughs> yo, she was like, yo, I want I want Milo this bad. Look, look at, look at the truck. I guess they're passing out free Milo. But wow, hello. So, yeah, they're passing out free Milo, so you have to like go line all the way. Hello. about this Milo, okay? What, what's the secret? It's not just any Milo. This is Milo truck Milo. This is like Malaysian childhood. This Milo will not taste like any Milo you've ever tried before. Is it Milo dinosaur? It's not Milo dinosaur. It's just Milo, but it's not just Milo. Milo special. It's it's going to taste so good. I don't want to hype it up too much, but it's going to be worth waiting in the queue for, okay? She's definitely hyping it up. <laughs> Big hype up, guys. No, but this Milo is so... So unique in flavor. It's better than Mama Milo. It's better than all the Milo. So it's worth the wait. All right, we'll see what you're talking about once we have it. Yeah, but the queue is quite long. Oh my God, guys! This is what we waited for all our life, my whole life of somewhat years. I'm not gonna tell you guys. This is the Milo. Look at this. Oh my God. This is pure gold. It is. It's like liquid gold. Liquid chocolate gold. Oh, nice. Milo. Terima kasih. Okay, selamat selamat. Hari, selamat hari Merdeka. No, selamat hari Malaysia. <laughs> All right, guys. You know the score. Let's see. Milo, we got the Milo. Milo is always going to be the best. All right, Barcelona. Barcelona, cheers. Cheers. Let's try out this Milo. This one. Yeah, it's the best. I said Bismillah, not yeah, it's the best. No, I'm just like, uh. Feedback? It's so delicious. It's the best, guys. No, I'm just playing. It's, it's really good. Uh, but it kind of reminds me of like normal chocolate milk. He didn't mean that. He really didn't mean that, okay? <laughs> he didn't mean that. This is the best. I think the one at the Independence Parade was a bit more chocolatey. It's good though, don't get me wrong. Like, I love, like, anytime you like, drink chocolate milk, drink Milo. It's really good. Milo is the best. I don't know, it has a very unique flavor. And it, the what I love about Milo too is you can have it hot, you can have it cold, and both are pretty good. Which one do you prefer? I think the Malaysia cold. Yeah, I think at, like a hot day like this, I prefer it cold. But if it's like kind of like a colder night, I remember when I was younger, I used to drink it sometimes hot. It was also nice as well. I think usually the hot Milo I find not as sweet as the cold one. I feel the cold one, they always add like more condensed milk. That, that could be possible. Mm. Oh, I love it. Should we get back in the queue? Let's get more. No, let's, let's just steal that. We're going to steal the whole container. <laughs> We're going to steal the whole container of Milo. YouTubers steal Milo truck. I can see it. Why not? I can see it in the news Alright, so we just finished from that area over there, which was nice. Milo truck and then a lot of other like activities such as you saw the Malaysian games. And then uh, over here, it's like some climbing course, like some climbing classes. Free entry. Free entry. Okay, fine. Uh, if you, want, if you love climbing, that's it for you. Unleash yourself. So they have some like climbing course. It kind of reminds me of like Ninja Warrior in, uh, in America. Or also they have in other countries like Ninja Warrior, some other stuff. You know what I'm talking about. It's pretty cool. 
A lot of food vendors over here. We got Uncle, Uncle Bob's fried chicken. AM Gunting, which is 13, 20. Mm. Jumbo cheesy wings. I'm right, just looking right now. Maybe you get something later. All right, guys, so we finally found a place to sit down in this nice shaded area right next to Master Jamik. That's Master Jamik over there, a famous mosque here in Kuala Lumpur. So I got some food. Elena got some food. What did you get over here? This is like a mango float. I think they had like ice cream on top, but it's kind of melty, but nice and sweet. You guys should know by now I love sweet things, mango. Bike. So if you guys don't know, now you know. Sweet things is for her. And I love mango too. Mango is actually one of my favorite uh, hey, I didn't fruits. Hey, you wanted to try. You want to try? No, it's alright. You already drank from it. <laughs> I just like it. It's okay. Are you a German folk? Sometimes it depends. But anyways guys, I got some other, uh, look at this, Uncle Bob's food. I would have showed you me actually ordering the food because you know I usually show it, like to show you there you stuff. But there was some music playing in the background and you know copyright issues but look at this it's like a corn dog a spicy corn dog there's some like meat some cheese and then this breading on it let's eat it as always Mm. Mm. so good and all this is for five ringgit for one usd how much was your drink by the way ah, sorry, it, was like, um, it was eight ringgit that's like less than two dollars usd can you believe this big of a drink, guys? Less than two dollars USD in America, that'd be like four or five dollars at least. Yeah, true. Same with the UK, kind of expensive. Yeah, probably like I don't know. You guys uh, in Scotland use pounds, right? Yep. So probably like five pound, maybe. Yeah, yeah, sure. Four or five pounds. All right, cool. So that being said, guys, I just want to say one more time: Happy Malaysia Day, Salamat Hari, Malaysia. Uh, I had a great time today, and also had a great time with you, Elena. So pleasure to see you another time, another Thank video. You for coming with me. My Hopefully. <laughs> yeah, last minute text. She texted me last night. She was like, yo, can you come with me and enjoy Malaysia Day? She was like, you got the tan jack on, you got the Malaysian flair, so you got to join me. So I was like, all right, let's go. But that being said, just in general, I really love the vibes over here. Malaysian people are very nice and they really like don't need anything to uh, get vibe and all they need is just like their soul. They don't need any like alcoholic drinks or something. So it's a really cool atmosphere. As always, don't forget to smash the like button and subscribe. And you can check out her channel as well. That being said, guys, love you so much. If you want to see more videos around Malaysia and around the world, click somewhere up on the screen. Merdeka, Malaysia. See you later.